Hello, my name is Hannah Burney. I was a contestant on The Voice. Um, I was in Danny Donoghue's team and this week, unfortunately, I left. He was just like, I'm so, so sorry. I was like, I understand. Because I understand that you have, someone has to make a decision. And, you know, I don't, I don't necessarily know what Danny was looking for. It may have been consistency. It may have been that I took a little a, a while to get going. It was only really until the live show that I made the biggest impact. Do you know what I mean? Before that, I'd done good performances. Mm -hmm. But maybe not like, <gasps> I got the dope. I've been waiting for a dope. The entire show, I was like, okay, someone's got dope. Am I dope? That was the question of the night. Is Hannah Bernie dope? And I am dope. That's cool. Well, that performance was anyway. My favourite is, um, 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 that was dope. He just, he says, um, a lot, and then he raises his eyebrows loads. His eyebrows are literally up here for most performances. <laughs> she had, like, comments about dancers and my dress and my shoes and, that's cool, and I actually, I did take that on board. I mean, I remember saying, I think I said thank you, because to be honest, maybe that wasn't the, the right thing for the show, maybe. But at the same time, it's a production decision. It's not my decision. At the end of the day, it really, it really was supposed to be about the vocals. So I'm not sure whether her comments may have influenced people, but they were probably just misdirected, and that, you know, that was a little bit gutting. Yeah, but at the end of the day, she said my vocal was flawless, and when that comes from Jessie J, and when it's supported by the other coaches, I do not feel bad.